myself Take me right back to the start Right then, it's that time to finally unveil the final match. What the top two Civil War teams will be up against. Now, there's been a few rumours going about that basically maybe it's just, I don't know, um, the captain picks one of his coaches and the other captain picks one of his coaches and they keep the rosters they've got and... Um, they fight out and whoever wins, wins the Civil War. I've also found out, apparently, um, it's going to be the, uh, is it the All-Star teams, where you're both picking All-Star team, load star players, all that shenanigans, and uh, that's how we're going to be. You know, the top, whoever finishes top gets first pick, and then the second, um, or the runner-up uh, team would pick whatever's left. That was a really, really popular um guess between the coaches and i'll be honest i did look at that the the, the thing what put me off about that was uh no re-rolls you know it, it would be cool to see them but no re-rolls that sort of put me off that um so what are we going to do that is the question <laughs> are we ready to find out what the final will be all right all right i suppose i better get on with it here we go then this is what the final game the final challenge will be listen carefully because i'm not going to be messaging and messaging and messaging and guess what messaging all the time on the uh, the discord channel um Anyone who hasn't gone on the Discord channel, it's called the Console Bar, but obviously we have PC coaches in there as well. It's a Discord channel where we all have good fun and have a laugh and uh, get salty and all that shit over our wonderful dice. Um, but here we go then. Here we go. Are we ready? This is what the finals game is. Oh, a Baron's Kickass. Let's have a look. And there we go. I wonder if anyone's figured it out yet. If they haven't, this is what it is. Both team captains will pick a mixed race team. Can have any mixed race team they want. Any single one. Okay. Easy as that. So this is a team I've just selected. I've just made them up. So, um, you know, look at them lovely oh, trolls, ogres, crocsigos, some orc blitzers in there, and some sort, and even a bombardier in there. These I picked the orcs because I know a Bannon loves orcs, so, so you know what? Let, let's let's do that. So, first things first, the captains will pick a mixed team. It's their choice. Uh, they can obviously take advice from their uh, players, but it's their choice. Next thing. <clears throat> As you can see, or I hope you can see pretty quickly, that the first 10 names on this uh, squad are all after the coaches in that Civil War team. So Bannon is the captain, and then obviously he's got all of his, uh, his coaches here. So, what every coach in the Civil War has is a character. Now, they can pick whatever they want. So, for this, they could have been an ogre, they could have been a goblin, they could have been... Um, a troll and they pick that player they are allowed two skills they're allowed a double if they want it and a normal or they can have two normal skills to add to their character the captain because he's the captain he's obviously a bit of a superstar he gets three skills and here's the kicker they can be anything they want they can be three doubles there can be three singles can be two doubles one single the only thing they can't do is have any stops there's no stops in in the in the round so if you want three doubles go for it now i understand things like cam all of a sudden a necro wolf gets really tasty also does a chaos warrior or chaos um beast man and shit like that but there'll only be one of them so it, it's not too op uh, you then are allowed another five players but they can obviously they'll be just named as they come so they'll have the default names and they are not allowed any 
uh, level ups or anything. So, for instance, uh, I took advantage of getting a, a goblin, um, a goblin fanatic, because they really don't need any skills. And then I do, I, I mean, there's no thinking in this at all. So, it wasn't like this was a tactical team. I just banged whatever I could. Um, so, you allow five, five of them. You're allowed as many cheerleaders, as many fan factor, as many coach assistants, and as many team roles you want. If you want eight team roles, by Jove, knock yourself out. Have whatever you want. But the kicker is this. There will be inducements allowed in this round for wizards, for um, brabs, for, for babes, and stuff like that. Um, so... This is where it gets a bit interesting because both captains will obviously want a really good team, but they won't want to be giving a lot of inducements out. So say, for instance, this one. This one's 2,160. Another one I did um, is this one. Uh, and this one's obviously 2,300. So the other team would have 140 inducements um, to play with. And obviously, there you go. There's this team. Again, just messed about with it. It's a nice uh, uh, troll slay pal on 12 slays there. Uh, loads of these lovely trees. And um, as you can see, we've got a jump up pal on tree. Uh, <laughs> had to put that in. Um, and a nice big death roller. So uh, as you can see, that, that's basically what it is. And this, this team's obviously um, just one I made up as well. So that basically is, it will go to overtime if need be. The captains will... Um, take control of the team if possible that's what i really want um now we know bannon will be one of them uh, the other one will be either durin shod or Azuin. um but obviously uh, feel free to have as many people in a part of chat with from your team and you can all discuss it or whatever i would just prefer the captains to have it if the captain for some bizarre reason cannot take their place then it drops down to the fair seed to the second seed and so on until we get someone who's willing to do it so um, there you go i'll also be hoping obviously to i will i will be streaming the game but obviously i would love to have two three um, coaches join me in uh, the booth for the final and make it into a party atmosphere and just it'll, it'll just be crazy so that is basically it. it's very very simple um you pick a mixed race team um, let me go pick mixed race team and there's so many of them look at this there's so many pick whatever you want and then when you get to it though don't forget to click that button um you know and then blah, blah, blah. Oh, you should all know how to create them but just in case and then yeah there we go no and then obviously you can pick your team easy as that so, for instance, you know, it can be all these, and then you just go to there. Oh, they're, they're lovely wolves. They could be tasty. Block them out, you blow on them bad boys. You can only have two, though. Um, and there you go. So, other rules will still be the same on the roster. So, for instance, you know, each roster's rules. So, for instance, Necro, you can only ever have two wolves. So, you ain't going to be able to spam it with wolves all over the place. Um, there is some places, like, for instance, like Halflings and Wood Elves. If they're both in the same mixed race, you could end up having three trees because you can have one for the f uh, one from the wood elves and two from the um, the flings. Um, but yeah, that's basically it. So there you go. That will be the final. It is mixed teams, and each player from that team will pick the wrong character and the wrong skills, and um, then they'll give them to uh, a banana or whoever the other one is, and. Um, and that'll be it. And then we'll, we'll sort of day to, to uh, stream it, make a big deal of it, and may the best Civil War team win and get the bragging rights. So there you go. Let me know if you think this is a good idea. I personally thought it was probably the best one out of so many things I tried. Um, I did try a, a game, and it was crazy. It was a lot of fun. Uh, I, I had um, Bombardiers throwing them left, right, and center. Well, I thought it was quite good. Um, so, yeah, let me know. And there we go. Thanks again. Bye-bye. Zombie Apocalypse. <laughs>